Hello everybody, my Storm here. Welcome back to Anno 1800. In the last episode, we were working on trying to expand and improve Crown Falls even more. Getting a bunch more residents in here. Getting our artisans expanded. Trying to meet their needs. Um, we've got our canned food up and running. We've got our sewing machines up and running. Um, we are looking to begin bringing in rum. That's kind of the next thing that's uh on on the docket here which we've actually done i think we got some rum production expanded and i believe i even have the ship set up to move the rum to cape trelawney yes that's going to crown falls so that goes into the crown fall supplies just so that i know what is being used to transport stuff there So, um, stand aside. Upgrade that. Uh, we upgrade that. Um, and expands our sugarcane harvesting. We also got the hacienda here up and running. So we're you know we're farming some corn here. Primarily, it's here to make some fertilizer off of the cattle farms here. And that will increase the fertility of any farms. It has a fertilizer silo. Of which the only farm that currently has a fertilizer silo is the one at the Hacienda. Now, the, the, the advantage of the Hacienda is, one... Um, it can do things, well, we can set a policy. Um, it can do things that actually are not possible on the island that it's on, at least. So, for example, we do not have cocoa um, fertility on this island, so I can't grow cocoa normally. But I could throw down a hacienda farm that grows cocoa, right? So that's a nice thing. It's also um, very compact. It's, it's very compact because, you know, this this little corn farm is, is very small compared to a standard corn farm. So um, it provides some, some of those advantages. So that's kind of nice. It's also the only way that you can make fertilizer. So. We're getting that going. We have tortillas. So gratifying to live here. So yeah. We can now supply those. And what I could do here is I could throw down a fertilizer silo. And that would increase the overall productivity of that entire farm. All right. So back to Cape Trelawney. We're waiting for that rum to get delivered. Uh, the ship should be on its way. In fact, there it is. Right there. It's almost in the, the area. So that's good. That will get our artisans happier. And will get us significantly more money out of them. That's the important part. All right, so. The next thing that we're going to need is we need 900 artisans here to begin doing fur coats. And we're going to want fur coats. Well, the fur for the fur coats come from the Arctic, I think, is what we're going to want. So. 
So let's get a bank of these upgraded. I see so. Now, as they get what they need, the numbers will come up. We might actually get enough to bring to get the university demand in here. We have to figure out where we're going to put the university. That's for sure. What we're probably going to do is make this another double road. We'll need to move. Those temporarily. Okay, so fur coats next. Is the ship with the rum in the area yet? There it is. All right. Your harbor is under attack. What? Well, ship under attack. That's a very unfortunate route for these guys to have taken. There's not much I can do about that other than uh, the ship was destroyed. Ah. Okay. Fleet moving in convoy. That's a very unfortunate route for them to have taken. Maybe what we need to do is get some more cannon towers in place. Because if we don't intercept them now, they're going to just cause nothing but trouble. Um, Moving to coordinates. Can, can you can you come along, please? Fleet embarking. Well, we got a clipper we need to get back in service. I need something to keep you going. Uh No, that's not the one that has an issue. Not that one either. I think it was the one that was the hops route. Yeah, that one. Okay then. Fleet moving in convoy. I think we're actually clear at this point. Fleet on the move. So let's get in here and let's knock these guys out before they even have a chance to do anything. Moving to coordinates. 
All right, get ready to cross there, T. Fleet on the move. Ship under attack. New orders. I don't have a ship with torpedoes, do I? I do, in fact, have a ship with torpedoes. Ah, uh, we don't really need them. Fleet en route. All right, head over here, get some repairs. We need that hops route back up and running because it's probably not going to take too long. For, well, no, we got a, a good stockpile, so it's not that super critical, but. Okay, what was I doing over here? I was looking to see if we were getting any rum. In fact, we are now getting rum. All right. We need to also check. Soap. Hand food. I had better leave it to set. We're good. Yeesh, that uh that guy needs some help. Alright. Busy people. Soap factory. We're okay for soap. Uh what about slaughterhouses? We are on the edge. Pig production is okay. We're gonna need another slaughterhouse. And we're going to need somewhere else to put them. Maybe. Let's just put it right there. We're short 30 workers. Hmm. Fresh as a daisy here. That will get what we need. I didn't build that. And I consumed the windows in an upgrade. Uh, because I'm silly. Uh All right. Well, we'll just grab a whole bunch of windows again and bring them over. On our way. All right, what I'm thinking about is we need more farmers. We need more farmers. I need another farmer enclave somewhere. I'm guessing over here is going to be it. Ship constructed. Perfect. A 
new commission? The Walrus 2. Walrus 2. There we go. These guys are repaired enough to go ahead and get back to uh, on the move. their position. All right. Yep. There we are. These guys are going to need a fishery. Don't mind a bit foraging. All right. What about work? Clothes. We're okay. Good. Anything Full else? Gladness. I make my best work. Uh, what about the sewing machines? Plenty. Okay. Now that fur. You know, if my gas extractors will stop exploding, uh, that would be great. Okay. Um. We have fur abundance here. It costs 40 explorers. Let's see. Uh, over here, we also have fur abundance. I need just 20 more explorers. Uh, and the reason why I want to do this here is because it is so much more efficient. My expectations were low to begin with. We can drop a couple of those because we don't need that many technicians. Okay. Now, where can I put you where you're not going to disturb anybody else? And you're going to be able to actually take advantage of all of your own stuff. Okay, what we would want to do another thing that needs to be on heat and it needs like room. Okay, 
here's what we're gonna do. Let's get a road up through here. We're gonna need We're gonna need a charcoal kiln. Do that up here. Okay. We're gonna need a heater. Do that there. Okay. We're going to need a small warehouse on the heat. And then we are going to need a prime hunting cabin. Right about there. Our tools are frozen solid. Once you get your delivery of coal, that'll be fine. Oh, I lost all sensation in my hands long ago. <laughs> there we go. We're going to need a boat to take that. Well, actually, we have an airship. We have an airship that is transporting This is technically Crown Fall supplies. Yeah, we have an airship that is transporting from here. So what we can have you do as well is load fur. And take it. Is that airship? Zambesa. I will be doing something with that eventually. Schnapps. Um and a and a pub. Of course. Uh the distilleries. Where are the distilleries? There they are. Now are you distributing that anywhere? I believe you are. We should be fine. All right. Ah, there's the airship. Okay, now what we're going to need to do is we're also going to need cotton here, aren't we? Fur coats. We are, in fact, going to need cotton. Uh, we're 
probably also going to need another small warehouse over here. Now that that's in place, let's take a look at you. Ooh, you don't actually have enough people. Interesting. There we go. Coming here was a dream. Yep, we'll be able to supply two of those fur coats factories from this single hunting cabin. That's good. Now, the new world. What can I do for you? The cotton mills. Now, you are taking the cotton to Storm Coast. Now, we have... Um... Cotton fertility here. We have cotton fertility over here as well. Storeroom's full, boss. I don't really have a ton of room. So, let's see. Could I potentially increase... You guys take fertilizer silos. You do. In fact, take fertilizer silos. I could get two of those farms improved. If we were to move one of those farms, yeah, lots of room over here, but question would be where. And are we starting to? No. We're just not getting enough dung fast enough. I think what also can produce dung are the alpaca farms. Where are the alpaca farms? Oh, for sure I... Oh, there's one. Let's move it into range over here. In fact, we probably need another one. Very good. Uh, let's get... More ponchos. 
And let's get another alpaca farm. See if I recall correctly, the alpaca farms are actually quite effective. It's grabbing dung from those alpaca farms. Very good. We're not bankrupt. We are not, yeah, well, bread shortage. Scarcity of bread in Haven. Are we even supplying bread there? Oops, I published it. I wanted to edit it, not publish it. Oh, well, it'll be fine. It'll, it'll be fine. Like... Oh, yeah, talk of the privileged. Yeah, we're not supplying anything here. Like, we're not even supplying sausage. I mean, I could, in theory. I mean, I could, I could ship over, um, grain. I mean, we've got Plenty of it stockpiled. Do I have a, an idle ship? Uh, maybe? I'm not going to worry about it. I'm missing particular materials. I am aware of this. Now. Need a clipper. Falls and Storm Coast will be good there. We're just a tad short on cotton. Uh, we can flip you around. Let's move you over here then. that for just a second. 
There we go. Replace that silo. Let's get you getting a silo in there as well. And then... Fertilizer silos have materials. And we have meet we're meeting production. Excellence. And do I have a stock? Pile building of. Uh, we have six in stock. All right. We are not there yet. We should be good to go ahead and stop here for now. Yeah, I think so. Actually, before we stop. Nope, nope, I don't want to hit that. Let's get this clipper built, and let's get the trade route moving the cotton going. Ship constructed. There it is. I'm just trying to find is where do we have it stored? There. Yeah, we got plenty. All right. Awaiting good. new horizons. Trade route. Here, I'm going to put in two. Two of those. Take them over here and unload them. Go. The people celebrate your leadership. One of the things I really should start thinking about doing is replacing a lot of these boats with um, airships. Ready for a challenge. I'll think about that. All right, but we'll go ahead and end this episode here for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.